gets going well in California. Oh. Not yeah. especially not in LA. <laughs> not in LA. No, I don't know what they're spending all my money on in California. That fucking mayor of LA. It, him and De Blasio should both get hit in the head with a meteor. Yeah, well, neither one of them make any sense. Letting criminals out of prison, not locking anyone up. You can't. I mean, in San Francisco, what do they? Yeah. You can't get. You can't get arrested if you steal less than nine hundred dollars worth yeah. of shit from the store. So people are just walking in the store stealing shit. It's crazy. And Chicago's doing the same shit. Do you see what happened in Chicago? They had a fucking gang fight in the middle of the street. They, they emptied 70 rounds, and they didn't charge anybody. Two people died. Another guy got shot, and they called it mutual combat. Did you see that? Mutual combat for didn't like see that? a yeah. fight fist between fight. you and me. Yeah, fist it's fight. Not a gun fist fight. fight. Like, I want to fuck you up. I want to fuck you up. And the cops will stand <laughs> yeah, by. Yeah. That's like Seattle. In Seattle, yeah, yeah. you can have mutual combat. Mutual combat. Yeah. So they did that for a running gun fight? You need to see this. You need to see this article because you're not going to fucking believe that it's real. Because two people died. They, they emptied 70 rounds on a crowded street. People were driving around the body. There's, a vi there's video footage of this fucking gang fight. 70 rounds. If you just shoot a gun in the street, you're supposed to go to jail. Yeah. You just empty a gun. You shoot at someone. Look at this. Prosecutors, re prosecutors reject charges against five suspects in deadly gang-related gunfight. See, now, this is where you get all tinfoil hat. Because a lot of people that, <laughs> Break like, them out. that George Soros <laughs> and all that kind of shit. Look at what, what, what the way he described it. A police report framed the state attorney's office decision to decline charges in a different light. He writes, mutual combatants was cited as the reason for the rejection. Mutual combat is a legal term used to find a fight or a struggle that two parties willingly engage in. Yeah, not a gunfight. That's insane. It's not a fucking gunfight. Guns, you shoot, those bullets don't stop until they hit something. They uh, go really fucking far. Yeah. They go a mile. <laughs> that's, ins that's insane. It's so dumb. Where is this? <sighs> it's where so does that dumb. End? The, the, that was the, you know, you and I talked about, I think it was the last time I was on, we were talking about defunding the police. Yeah. And, and you, you, you talk to police and... It's gnarly right yeah. now. It yeah. is gnarly. Yeah. You know, they have their, a lot of police are just leaving. Yep. They're getting out of the police yep. because it's, it's a, so, such a tough environment for them right now. They have so much at risk. People go, what makes it tougher? Well, when you know that you are, if you make a mistake, you're going to burn for it. Yeah. I, I, you, what are you going to do? Am I really going to pull over this car? Like, am I going to roll the dice? I'm pulling over this car and roll the dice that I get into some kind of altercation. Or I say the wrong thing. And all of a sudden I'm getting, I'm getting in trouble because of this. You're no, all over no, social media. You know what I mean? I'm just going to sit here and just let people speed and do whatever and yep. whatever. And, and crime is going up across the country. Yep. It's a, it's a total disaster. It's a and total in these disaster. places like where George Floyd died, they're trying to refund the police right now. Yeah. They're like, hey, this is a mistake. We fucked up. Like, <laughs> Look, you, you can't have bad cops. You can't have cops that are killing people. You can't have cops that are abusing people. But you know what the best way to stop that from happening is? More cops. Yeah, more cops. That's what people... Better training, better screening. Invest yeah. in cops. Yes. Get them, get them screened better. Yes. Pay them more so you yes. get a higher level of people that want to do that job. Yeah. They're making mistakes all over the place. But this kind of shit makes me think, man, it's almost like someone is being paid like when when you hear these George Soros stories, mm -hmm. well, he's trying to destroy the country from within by by putting in these people. Like he's the guy who put in the guy who's the DA in Los Angeles mm -hmm. that's letting people out, just lets people out. The guy pulled a, a knife on a fucking sheriff, and they let him out a couple of weeks later. And he hacked some guy with in front of his family oh, with a machete. I yeah, read about that. what the fuck, man? That was a guy that should have been in jail. That's a violent person who pulled a weapon out on a police officer. At any other sane time in history, that guy would be in jail. He'd be charged with uh, attempted assault on a police officer, and he would get a good sentence. At some point, the parents are going to come home from this weekend party and square some shit away. Jesus, I hope so, <laughs> but these fucking kids are coming out of school over and over again with these ridiculous ideas in their head. They're, they're, they're being indoctrinated it's, by these universities. Yeah, yeah. The, the, the university system right now is crazy. It, yeah. It's crazy. And it's being run by people who have never lived in the real world. These are not real world people. These are people that have been babied by this intellectual echo chamber in these universities and then they're teaching more people to live like them yeah. and to teach more people these same ideas and they're all being funded by crackpots yeah yeah <laughs> <laughs>